Hello everyone, welcome back. In this video, we would learn how to solve the practice problem count squares. So let's understand the question first. Basically, we are given an n value 9. Now we know that 9 is a perfect square, right? It is 3 into 3. But we need to find perfect squares before 9. So basically, there are two perfect squares before 9 that are 1 into 1, that is 1. And second one is 2 into 2, that is 4. Now, if I count these two squares, that means my output is 2, right? So, this is what you have to do. You are given a value n. You need to find the perfect squares before that value and you need to print the count of them. I hope the question is clear to you. Now, let's solve it. What you need to do is, you need to go to the practice portal. In practice portal, in the difficulty section, choose basic. Then, you need to find the problem count squares. Once you find the problem, you need to click on solve, okay? So, let's solve the problem. Here is the question. Let's read it. Consider a sample space S consisting of all perfect squares starting from 1, 4, 9 and so on. You are given a number N. You have to output the number of integers less than N in the sample space, okay? I hope the question is clear to you and we would be coding it over here, okay? So, let's start. It's a very easy question. You just need to write return int. What do I need to return int? Over here, I need to write math dot square root, okay, of what? Of n minus 1, okay. Now, I would click on compile and run to check if it is correct or not. Compilation is completed. My output is matching with the expected output. So, now I would submit the given problem. The problem is solved successfully and this is how you solve the practice problem count squares. I hope this video was helpful for you and you guys enjoyed it. If you guys have enjoyed this video, make sure you click on the like button and thank you for joining me today. Thank you.